Hey everyone, my name is Jamie Lee. Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching this video today. Now today I am going to be reviewing the Birds Papaya and Launder Bodywear collaboration swimsuit, which is of course this beautiful piece that I have on that has a vulva print. That's right. This entire bathing suit is covered in flowers that, as you can tell, um, look a little bit like something else. Now, this collaboration could not have come at kind of like a better time. I obviously love the Bird's Papaya. I also have been creeping the Launder Bodywear website for a while now looking at the minimalist one piece which is what this is because it just it looks super cute their models always look like they're having so much fun they are very size inclusive running from like an extra extra small to a 5xl in both regular and long lengths in most of their bathing suits all of those things seem great they seem like they're very size inclusive they really embrace like the body positivity messages that i also care a lot about and then when i saw that this collaboration featured a pattern that's literally called where's vulva you know that i had to be a part of it <laughs> now this bathing suit was $116 Canadian, so I would say a little bit on the pricier side, obviously, but for the most part, it seems like this company does sell like high quality pieces in general. It's not like a discount retailer of bathing suits and loungewear and that kind of thing. They do seem like they really care about providing high quality pieces. Now, all of these bathing suits are supposed to be made with the female shape in mind. So they do have very different cuts than some other places do. This bathing suit, I mean, you'll see the whole thing in a second, but it has no back at all. And yet somehow these straps stay on, which I have had some wardrobe malfunctions before with swimsuits like this. I don't think that would happen in this one. Now, because this was a collaboration piece, I don't know if they're going to bring it back, but they do have this exact swimsuit in a load of other colors and patterns. And there's always the hope that they could bring it back in the future. So if you are interested in this style of swimsuit in a different color, be sure to check them out. I will of course link them down in the description box below and this is not a sponsored review. It is completely brutally honest my own opinions as always. Now obviously you can see the top right now while I have this little sarong on and it's decently low cut. There's definitely a decent amount of cleavage. If you want more cleavage with this you can literally like grab your boob move it over a little bit and you will get a little bit more it does hold pretty well like i do feel secure i feel like i'm held in place now if you had very very small boobs or like you were pretty flat chested unless you got a very small size i do think that that could be an issue like i could see you kind of like slipping out one or the other side whereas if you had larger chest i do think this would actually keep you in like I said, I feel very, very secure in this, even though there is like a little bit of side boob action. Now, let me just take off the sarong and we can kind of look at her in her full glory. Now, this is not meant to be like a super cheeky bathing suit. It's supposed to be somewhat of like a medium coverage. And like, I do feel like this is decent coverage if you don't like something that's ultra cheeky. I usually prefer something that's a little cheeky but not like a thong because I most often go swimming at my mother-in-law's house and I don't want my entire butt out in front of my mother-in-law. But if you have somewhere that you go that's a little more private and you want that more cheeky coverage, they do have other bathing suits that would be a little more cheeky for you. Or if you feel comfortable doing this, you can always size down in this and that obviously would provide you with more cheek now as you can see the back is super super low it has that ruching detail just above your butt which really does like hold this whole thing back like i said it does not feel like the straps are going to slip off my shoulders at all i feel very held in here and secure 
I do feel like there is a slight bit of compression on your belly. So if that's something that maybe you wouldn't be comfortable having a bit of compression while you're swimming or while you're tanning, this might not be the one for you, though I do feel like it's gotten a slight bit looser while I've been wearing it. Now, I got this in a size medium. I do think that the medium fits well. I would not want to size down because I feel like it would probably dig in if I did. Though I will say the size medium, shockingly, is a little loose on my butt, which is where I actually usually size up in swimsuits so that they're not too tight there. This one doesn't seem to have that problem. I do think that these are like true no dig seams, so they're not going to dig into you even if it's a little bit too small for your butt. Now let's come closer so that you can really see the pattern. I absolutely love this. I love the shades of pink and red, the little green flowers. I just think that it is absolutely such a cute pattern. I really love the message, and this is a message that I care about, that I know that this company and that the Birds Papaya Sarah Nicole care about, which is love your body. It shouldn't matter what you look like. You deserve to be respected by other people no matter what. And if somebody is disrespecting you because of your size or your appearance, or because you have hip dips or because you have stretch marks, that's a problem with them, not with you. You don't need to fix yourself. You are perfect as you are. So let's remember as we go into summer, especially now as it seems like some things are going to start reopening, we don't owe anybody a perfect body. Hot girl summer is a vibe. It's not a body type. You don't need to starve yourself or go on a crash diet or start working out 14 hours a day to fit like some crazy ideal. Just, you know, drink a little more water. Let's make sure we're all eating our veggies and our fruits every day and fuck what other people think. Sorry, I said it. <laughs> now in terms of quality, this is obviously a very high quality swimsuit. The way that the seams sit, the way that this fits without feeling like it's tugging on your shoulders, even though these tiny little straps are supporting everything else and keeping it there and holding you in. It really feels like a high quality bathing suit that is giving you a hug and embracing your curves truly feels incredibly high quality. It's very soft. Like I said, it's not digging in anywhere. And I really, really like how it looks. Now, like all of these types of bathing suits, you could pull this to be a little bit more high cut if you wanted that. Alternatively, you could pull it down even further if you wanted it a little lower down. I do think you could customize a little bit with your fit in this one. If you have hip dips and you are insecure about them, this kind of one piece where it falls here versus being higher or lower, I think accentuates them a little bit. I know I have pretty severe hip dips because I'm tiny with wide hips and very small legs. <laughs> so I have kind of the perfect storm, but I've just come to embrace them. Nobody cares about them in real life. It's something that you care about when you see them in pictures. Nobody actually judges you on that when you're at the pool. Nobody cares. <laughs> so all in all, I love this swimsuit. I will be rocking it this summer. I think that this one is appropriate enough that I can wear it at my mother-in-law's house. And I can't wait to show off my Where's Vulva print. Now, definitely let me know if you like this swimsuit or not, both the style and the pattern. Although I can't see why anybody wouldn't like this pattern. Like, come on, it's adorable. And also let me know if you prefer one pieces or bikinis. I used to wear only bikinis no matter what. Lately, I feel like companies have really been upping their one piece game and some of the one pieces are just like so much cuter than the bikinis they're putting out. It's like everybody has their string bikinis for sale and then they have these crazy intricate one pieces that are completely different from anything you've seen before and it's like well i already have 15 string bikinis how many can i get <laughs> so let me know team one piece 
or Team Bikini? I would love to know in the comments. Now, if you did enjoy this video, definitely be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also be sure to hit the big red subscribe button found down below to make sure that you don't miss any videos coming out in the future. You can also hit the bell notification icon to be notified when I post. I usually put out a new video every single week. And thank you very much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day, a wonderful week, and I will see you next time. Bye!